what is up? Greetings and salutations, YouTube. As you guys can see, it is your host with the most, Hillbilly Cantu, reporting live and direct with an exclusive trip to the thrift video. Now, in this here video, I'm going to go to Goodwill. I'm going to see what I can find for my new place and uh, basically just show you guys how I can save loads, as my brothers in the South say, of dinero and acquire a bunch of really cool items to make your western house look even more western than it already does. This is my song. Full moon shining bright. Edge of the water, we were feeling all right. Damn, I ain't seen this much damn herd since I was out there in the middle of the Great Plains shooting down some fucking buffalo. I, I grabbed one by their testicles and actually wrestled it down to the ground and, and then punched its brains out and then I shot it in its ass. <laughs> As you guys can see right now, we're at Good Willard. So I'm about to go in here, got my nice gloves that I used to slap coyotes with when they're charging up my cattle. I'm gonna put these on hand and Without further ado, let's just gonna get straight into it, you know what I mean? <laughs> the ambiance in here is just lovely. So we might have to get ourselves a cart and just, you know, see what's going on, you know what I mean? Right now we're talking, baby. We're rolling with this luxurious blue wagon right here. Wish it had a canvas cover to protect all the, the flame I'm about to find, but uh, we're just gonna go ahead and park it up against the wall and and go in there and see what we got over here, you know? Lord have mercy, looks like I got a bad case of the bins, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Look at this little guy over here, cuddly critters. I like to get all cuddled up with that dude right there tonight, you know what I mean? <laughs> Just kidding, we fuck women's, not animals. Now this is in great condition, as you can see, a little bit of hard field work was done in this. I might have to add this to the collection. Now what in the hell are these naked critters doing over here? They got little wings on them and stuff. See, this is what happens when you're fucking your sister. And we don't do none of that shit all the time. Wow, look at this guy. Now, this is patriotic. You got an Eisenhower golf club. We all know golf is for them lames. We go out and we shoot them eagles down, damn it. But it got a nice American flag, so you really can't be mad at this. What else we got? What in the hell? Now this ain't a bully little pussy boy. This is just great right here. Nice placemats to keep your burnished tables clean and stainless. One of the best presidents right here. We got another, another great candidate and uh, serving president right here. George Herbert Walker Bush. Now this, this I might have to get now. Right here is a great catch. We got a big mouth Billy Bass. And uh, I'll be jiggered if this thing ain't just absolutely exquisite. And I'm probably going to go ahead and acquire this for the win. Oh, wow. And then look what we got over here. Nice western, red western button up. Look at that. Got cacti on it. Some succulents. Oh, Lord. This is just a dream come true with these two finds right here. Now, this might be something I get for the old lady back home. She wasn't a damn slut. Fucking whore. We got some fresh pickings right here. We got more of this uh, inorganic fruit. These GMOs. We don't fucks with GMOs anyways. There's nothing more than I like to see in the world than a wicker basket woven. Nice a beer cap encrusted and encapsulated cowgirl hat for the women's out there. Now, I love to see me a fine, fine young whippersnapper wearing this at the pool or in hell even. Even, you know, might creep up, get a some candy flavored core form and just go to work on her, you know what I'm saying? Alrighty, well, your boy Hillbilly Can too managed to get as much footage in there as I possibly could before I was removed from the premises. Look at these boulders. They, uh, they let me know that there is no videography, a video recording, or uh, any of the taking of the, the pictures in there, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut this short right now, but don't worry, guys, I'm gonna show you what I find in there, because I'm gonna keep digging and I'm gonna acquire some fire. I'll be jiggered if I don't, damn it. <laughs> Shit on! I'm back right now from the, the thrifting adventure over there. And I found a lot of good stuff before security came and shut down my whole parade, you know what I mean? So right here is you guys. Look at that shit. This, this got fish on it, damn it. And it was originally $7.99 right here. And I got this for about 25 fuckers. Now the next shirt we got here is some denim dynamite. It's this western button up right here by 
by Banana Republic. Now, I'm not sure who in the hell would name a country the Banana Republic. That sounds like the place where all them queers go, you know what I'm saying? I, I wouldn't be too angry if we went over there and thought you was an annex this motherfucker. But I really like it nonetheless. It has some pearl snaps straight from the bottom of the ocean right here. Nice detailing on the back. I mean, this is classic Western wear. Similarly speaking, we got some more denim dynamite. It's this overall set right over here. Now, this isn't Wrangler, so it, it's not the, the best quality tie, but it still is really durable looking. Now, these other pieces I wish were in men's, but I had to go ahead and grab them for, for the little lady. I got this here cacti encrusted shirt right here. Now I really like this because I'm infatuated by succulents and I like when she sucks my lint off my dick. <laughs> and then another piece I got to ward off them damn commies and them Comanches and everybody trying to trespass in my private land. I have this hunting jacket. This is military grade, it's quality. It's great for hunting them teenagers who like bags of shit aflame on my porch and they can get away with it, little motherfucking coon hockeys. I'll go over there and fucking stick my boots up far up their ass that their damn teeth will be on my damn motherfucking shin splints. Some other pieces I got for my personal uh, dappering of myself down is this Texas hat. Now, I like this because I'm Texas. If you ain't texting, you ain't living. If you ain't living, that means you're dead to me. Another whipper snapper of a piece I got is this, this hat. This is by Eddie Brand, and, and Eddie was my best friend since the second grade. I'll definitely be wearing this when I go wrangle some cattle. Shit, I look like a fucking warden when I'm wearing this. God forbid I look like a DPS officer. I hate them motherfuckers when I'm over there collecting the dead coons off the street, getting some armadillos that got hit by 18 wheelers. They want to go in there and tell me I can't cook them. What in the hell I'm doing you a service, motherfucker? All right, and then some other stuff I got that isn't no longer clothing related. I got this here, Big Mouth Billy Bass. Now, this guy can sing, he can dance, he can do everything you can possibly imagine. But I don't know really how to operate this, so he's just staying like this for now. Another piece I got is for my own personal protection and hunting, and this is a relic. Now this is this is some some classic Indian tomahawk hatchetry right here. It says it's made in Tijuana, but this thing is sharp. I can definitely behead a couple people. Get a get a couple grizzlies. Oh, David Crockett like him. Whoa! So I also got these here moonshine glasses. This one got some fruit on it. Probably filled up with some white lightning. I'm really looking forward to that. I got another one too. This one says Kerr Self Sealing Massin. Probably fill this up with a little bit of lighter fluid. Someone comes up my property, have myself a nice little uh, Roman candle mason jar dish. You know what I'm saying? You know, blow their fucking face off. <laughs> and then last but not least, what I got are uh, these here flowers. Now you're not be like, you ain't been a can too. Why in the why in the hell you got these? Now uh, I actually got these for my wife Winnie. God rest her soul. Last time I I remember seeing her, I was encouraging her to go ice skating on the creek with some cinder blocks attached to her, her skates, and uh, she did. Needless to say, she uh, never came back. So, uh, if you want to be a dirty little whore, I'm just going to let you know where you're going to end up. So, uh, I miss you, Winnie. And, uh, I hope that everything you got was deservingly given to you. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely be sure to give it a, a big old thumbs up. And if you didn't like it, give it a big thumbs up. Anyways, if you don't like me, fuck you. If you're gonna burn some stuff on my porch, then go ahead and do it. I got I got a sweet, pleasant surprise waiting for you in this here cur jar. But it doesn't matter. It ain't nothing but a chicken wing. I, I'll see you guys next time. And uh, shout out to my, my nephew, Mordecai. I know you're watching this and you're gonna be the How's that big old piece of lumber looking right here? That's a big old piece of American sausage treating you. It's treating you nice. It's treating you nice.